What's going on, bro? <sighs> Same. Tired from the tired, baby and that. Tired, bro. I can imagine. I've got a fact for you, though. It might Go lift on you. Then. Go on, then. Did you know that the bird on the Twitter logo has a name? No, I did not. And his name's Larry. Is it? Dead name. Larry. Dead name. <laughs> Which, you mean That's a good fact. That's a good fact, isn't it? All right, so the club season is officially over. That's the door closing. It's, it's officially... It's no, over. no, club is officially over now. You see, we thought it was over when the Premier League ended. Then we thought it over when the FA Cup final okay, ended. Okay, I get what you mean. And now, Champions League, yeah, yeah. done. It's over. And then we've got the international games coming up. And then after that, it's definitely over. So the footballers come off their holiday to international, back to the holidays. Michael Carrick's testimonial was yesterday. Good oh, game. So was that the last game then? Exactly. Carragher rattled Gary Neville. Have you seen the video? No. Oh my God, it was amazing. I think I'm going to sit down and watch that. Got Actually, better it was better than, better than real football. What? Was Why? Pantomime? Yeah. Oh, great. Here we go. It always happens. Anyway, guys, look, we've got loads of content coming out, so make sure you're subscribed to the channel. Make sure you drop it a like if you're feeling the series. And uh, Steve-O is going to be back in Cardiff. We was in Cardiff. Obviously, we did the live show. If you haven't seen that, make sure you check it out on the channel. He's going to be doing a Hold the L with some Wales players. Are you yep. excited for that? Wales players. Welsh. You can say both. No, you can't. They play for Wales. Um, yes, I'm excited. So do we say England players or English players? England players. Yeah, so with some Wales players. I don't know, is that right? Is he right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I'm, you know. I'm excited. All right, let's get on with the comments. All right, so Kieran Rogers said, quality live show, Defo need to do more. Yes. Big up, big I enjoyed up. it. I really enjoyed it. I enjoyed yeah, it, it with the people in the background as well, yeah. putting in their two pence. Heckling. I really enjoyed it, yes. Yeah, Heckling all Craig. Uh, Buddha Finger said, yes, Craig and Steven enjoyed all your shows. Hope this, sh this show sorry, grows bigger next season. So do I. My team. So, so do I, yeah. so do I. But it's only going to grow bigger if you guys spread it. Show it to people and just keep saying how good it is. So you have to watch this. When you say stuff like spread it, it makes me, it gets me worried. Only your mind would go there. I'm on about, you know, I'm on about when you've done that toast for me and you didn't go around the edges with the butt. What oh, are you thinking? Yeah, what is he thinking? Umet Kara Arsenal said, LOL, man said Vidal at Juve, I'm dead. Steve, you was right, FFS. I know I was right. What? Listen, there's a backstory to this and I'm not going to go into it, but put it this way, I made a mistake. Yeah, that's it. That's the, forget the backstory, you made a mistake. Can right. I read the next one? Go on. Um, this one's from Jala Penfield. Steve-o, 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 stop underestimating Serie A. Juve, Napoli and Roma are so good. I said they're coming back, but at the end of the day, yet. no, they're not there yet. And the league, for me, is quite boring. All right, let's kick it off with the first post anyway. You ready for this? Yeah, yeah. All right, so Phil, Phil Neville said, Ronaldo is better than Messi. And then Joey Barton retweeted and said, stay off crack, Phil. Whoa! Wow. Because he, he does actually look like Phil, Phil, um, Phil Neville. Yeah. yeah he, does, he doesn't look right. Cristiano Ronaldo, man, he, he made Real Madrid get 12 Champions Leagues. Mm -hmm. He took them there. 600 career goals, bro. His fourth Champions League, bro. He won with United and he's won three with Real Madrid. I think someone Is said, this conversation now open? No. I see someone well, say something like the other day because Messi is the best player uh, uh, and best assister and... You're saying just all-round player? He's just the best player, but Ronaldo is the best player, best goal scorer. Or even that's debatable. No, bro. no, it's not. How's it debatable? He scored more than Messi. Has he? Yeah. What do you mean, in general or for club or what? Just, he scored more goals. How old is he? About two years older than Messi. Okay, so Messi's got Messi two started years. two years younger than him. So Messi got Messi another two years. two years younger than him. Messi got another two years. Messi started two years younger than him. Messi got another two years. See, you don't even know what you're talking about. What are you talking about? Anyway, when it's all said and but, done, no, 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 so, so, Messi so, 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 has the most goals at the end of their career. But I'm saying for now, so he's not, he doesn't score more. My than point Messi. is, just celebrate both. One's a great goal scorer. One's a great player. Oh, that's fun. No, yes. bro. That's how it goes in rap. That's how it goes in other sports. You take the two best and compare them. No, you don't. It's right, so on to the next post, and it's still on the topic of Cristiano Ronaldo, the man of the moment of the last decade, to be honest. He posted a picture on Instagram after the Champions League final with a brand new haircut. Check this out. Mad ting. And he said, do you like it? Wink. Bro, he looks like a roadman. What's going on? He's got a fade. You know what I like about Ronaldo? He's trying. Yeah? He's got a fade. He's trying. He still looks... I was gonna say cute. <laughs> Still looks what? handsome. I don't know if it's the lighting, but he looks grey. But I like grey. I'm getting a bit. I'm getting a bit of grey. Idris effect. Um, Idris effect. Hmm. I don't know What's Ronaldo. I don't know man. Ronaldo. It's, it's a bit jarhead. Is this the winner's trim? 
Should we be going to get this trim? This is the trim of a guy. Should we who, just cut him? Who can do anything he wants. Yeah? Yeah. Do you think because little kids are going to flock to go and get this hair? Well, started? no, because if my little kid come home with this haircut, I'll be taking him back to the barbers and I'll be offering the barber out. That's the true story, yeah. Fair enough. Santan Dave, let's get on with that. He said, imagine paying 80 million for Ronaldo when guys like Mbappe are getting quoted for 105 million. Priceless. So he's basically saying, this is ridiculous. Real Madrid paid 80 million, and then teams are bidding 25 million more, aka Arsenal, for a player who's not really proven. Mm. Mm. I could say the same about some of the old tunes that have only got 30,000 views, but then Dave brings out a tune and get 8 million. But the other tunes are better than Dave's tunes. I don't get that analogy. You don't get that because times have changed. There's more money in football. There's more views yeah, on but, YouTube. Yeah, but, yeah, but. No. Ridiculous, no. no, but here's the principle in my opinion. Ridiculous price tags, and it's still a ridiculous price tag, even in this climate, yeah, need to be justified. And it's not justified. When Ronaldo was bought by Real Madrid, hold on, when he was bought by Real Madrid, He'd already won the Champions League. He won a couple titles. He was like golden boot winning in the Premier League. He was proven. Mbappe is a kid who had a great season for Monaco. You can't compare the two. Because you can't compare him because we don't know what he's going to do yet. He might go there and bang it up. Yeah, but that, that's what I'm saying. You don't bid that ludicrous money well, on, on hyper Sorry, I don't even know why I said that. I already answered your question. Football's changed. That's it. Do you think Mbappe could get to Cristiano Ronaldo's level eventually. Do you think he's in that calibre? No. So not, not at the moment. No, well, ever. saying that. I don't saying think that when, when Ronaldo was 18 and Mbappe's 18, Mbappe is ahead of Ronaldo. But there's loads of players that are probably ahead of Ronaldo when they were 18, but... Not really, because Ronaldo was still doing his team, but no, not like was. this guy. But this guy's doing his team. They fall off. Yeah, they do. What about Twitter do? Wow. One sec, I answered your question. All right. All right, Grinsby Town winger Dembele's unusual route to league football. So look, we got, we to got talk him about this. We, we got, got him this move. We got to talk about this, man. Like, can I talk about this one second? Okay, before? you go. You go. So, we done a video watching the Nike Academy against Manchester City. Then Bele played. Yeah. We gassed him up. We really did gas him up. The video is on 143,000 views. Yeah. Right. Next week he gets scouted <laughs> by Grimsby. I I ain't saying I mean, it's because of us. I just I don't know. You know there, how many how many views did it get again? Just one more time. Oh, that's not, it, it's not that it's got. At the moment, it's, it's got. It's, like it's only a, been out a week. I'm just saying. It's not like I mean, a hundred, you know, a lot of people. I think a lot of scout. So basically, we're doing the scouting work. All right, shrimping season. Yes, we're back to shrimping season. Meow. These are all the <laughs> shrimp sound. The shrimp, shrimps that make sounds. It's crazy when you catch them. Meow, meow, meow. All through the nets, man. I can't believe. Confirm that this. someone, someone I that lives on the river or the, the, the sea, yeah. The river, the sea. Confirm that, because I mean, they must hear it through their windows when they're getting caught. Cool. Yeah. Anyway, shrimping season. Yeah, so yeah. the Sun, don't know why we're quoting them, but whatever. Leicester willing to pay 30 million for Gilfie Sigerson after conceding Arsenal will nab Riyad Ooh. Mahrez. Wow, so this could be the domino effect going around according to the Sun. <laughs> so believable. Do you play dominoes? No, I eat dominoes and that's where it stops. Oh, okay, it's probably me like that. Yeah. Sharp. So Look, sharp. this is what I'm going to say, yeah? Gilfie Sigerson, mm -hmm. 30 million. Mm -hmm. I think he is criminally underrated. I was annoyed when Spurs let him go, if I'm totally honest, to keep Chadley, who we ended up letting go anyway. Oh, do me a favour. But anyway, he's been batting up for Swansea for the past couple of years now. Can score free kicks, score type of goals. He's a playmaker. Apparently, apparently, mm. Leicester are going to take him if Real Mahrez goes to Arsenal. I love Sigerson, want him at West Ham. Surprised at the 30 million price tag. Do you think he'll do well at Leicester, Sigerson? Is that a step up or a step no, down from Swansea? Um, They're basically the same right now. I yeah, know Leicester yeah. won the league, but that's never happened. He needs again. to come to West Ham. That's definitely a step up from Swansea. Uh, the rumour mill have said sources say Louis Van Gaal will manage Crystal Palace next season. Mad thing. Who would want him? He's gone, he's past it. I'm sorry. I'm I mean, sorry. This, is, this is the perfect shrimp. It was a great. This is the perfect shrimp tweet. Louis Van Gaal to Crystal Palace. He's good at man management, the players loved him, sorry. Yeah. But he's very, very boring. He's very, very repetitive. But he's uh, a winner. What did he win? FA Cup. He's got loads of trophies. He, he's just a winner, he knows how to win things. Is that what Crystal Palace it's, it's, needs? It's, it's, it's do you want... Like for me... Crystal Palace need a trophy, bro. Mourinho... Oh, but they got you, Lego in their cabinet. You start playing. I've seen it. You start... You know what, he could probably manage a Palace. He'd probably do really well for them. Yeah? Yeah. 
Because he's so structured with them teams, you just get them structured and you, you, you get what you need. Like Sam Allardyce, he would get you what you need. Now, what we was asking from uh, Van Gaal at United yep. was to push further. I don't think he could push further anymore with his dated tactics. Was it, I think he would do well, Palace, as he goes. I hear that. Wasn't he the man that sold Zaha? Played a, Zaha played a season under Moyes, didn't work, and then when LVG came in, he left. Yeah. But wonder how that's going to pan out. No, nah, but L LGV will say, look, I, I didn't get a chance there, but it was good, yo. It was um, Zaha be salty. I told you as soon as I signed that flipping extension, Zaha. Good, now look yo. who's coming in, the man that got rid of you. Come good. over to the winning side, bro. The, the, team, the team that puts the pressure on and finishes good. second. Good, yo. All right, Mirror Football, we're continuing. Shrimping season Zeska. still here. Zeska. Zeska. <laughs> Bulu, I don't even remember what they say. Man City beat enough. Liverpool and Chelsea to 60 million signing of Southampton. Defender, Madness, Virgil bro. Virgil van Dijk. Now, this isn't confirmed. 20 million cheaper than Ronaldo, like is. by the way. If you're going on by that yeah, whole yeah, thing. Yeah, absolutely ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Obviously, he's a good player. Yeah. Uh, he has been, you know. Is he the best in the Premiership, defender-wise? No, no, of course. It's Toby Alderweireld. However, he's been good the last few seasons. Mm. He's been up there. I have to give him his props. Southampton have looked good with him there. But 60 million, bro, that will be a world record for a defender. It's absolutely ridiculous. Here's my thing, right? Because I'm like this, yeah? So, say, for instance, I'm out. Yep. And uh, I see saying I want it. And I want it. And the guy's like, ah, oh, man, this is the last one. I'm, I've got it on hold for this person. <laughs> yeah. I'll be like, look, mate, how much does it cost? He'd be like, 20 pounds. I'll be like, look, I'll give you 40 now. He's like, ah. I'll, look, I'll give you 40. He goes, man, why do you want to give me 40, man? It's only worth 20. I'm like, look, I'll give you 40. He's like, all right, go ahead. I'll get out of some of my mates like, man, you're mad. You overpaid for that. I say, I don't care. I had the money and I wanted it. <laughs> He's shining, B. He's shining. I can see you do stuff like that. Now, me? Oh, look at look at. look at. Is it stuck? Seriously, no. <laughs> Jesus. That's dangerous, you know? Wow. We'd have to go to the dentist again. See me shining, yo. <laughs> No, listen, see me, I hear your point. Yeah. I'm the type of guy that goes in there and goes, mate, can I get 15? 50, all right, you know what, 16. All right, I'll meet you halfway, 17, 50. That's what I do. Yeah, and that's why you won't get the thing. And then I will come in and say, bang, 40. You've got to haggle, man. No, you, you don't haggle. haggle. Definitely haggle, but I think the, the day and age of haggling in the Premiership has well and truly gone. Especially if you're Manchester City and your owner is worth like yeah, 100 exactly. million. That's so I, I, what is 60 million to him, bro? Stop, stop. Can we pause shrimping season for a second? Okay. Just got word that Jordan Henderson has completely shut down the gram. He clearly listens to Skepta. He's about this life. He's posted this picture and he said, what a day, what a breakfast. <laughs> bro, what is he doing? Seriously, look. He's got the Nike FC shirt on. He's got the red hat. He's got the sunnies covering his I eyes. I, I don't and know he's got a poached egg with avocado well, on a muffin I, with crust. I don't know if you can see this, but... And he's got one poached egg on a crumpet this side and one poached egg on a crumpet that side and a big avocado through the middle. I can't help but think that looks a bit like an elephant and its trunk. Ah. Don't Maybe you think? Said, you should work for Disney. I just think it looks a bit weird, and he's, anyway. He would say he's boring. But he's really boring, though. It's, I can't believe he made the cover of FIFA, that's all I'm saying. I mean, it's, it's, that, that breakfast isn't boring. It looks like a real good time. Bruv, and Crest. I was saying the other day, who eats Crest? I used to grow that at school, on the windowsill. Oulou, voulou, fex, ya, che quoi, che quoi. Oulou, voulou, voulou, che quoi, che quoi. Oulou, voulou, oulou, vou quoi, vou quoi. A real challenge time. Yeah. You got the melody right, but the lyrics were all over the place. I changed it a little bit. Okay, anyway. I don't want to say what the girls are saying. I said it in my own way. Challenge time. Translate that. We're here. Seven British players have scored in Champions League finals, and this week we're going to be challenged to name them all. Are you ready for that, OK? What? We're going to give each other the year in which the player scored in a Champions League final, and then we'll have to guess which player it was who scored. Oh, cool. Yeah? Cool. Light work. <laughs> Light work. For me? No, for me. OK. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Ah, rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Ah, rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Bang. Which British player scored in the Champions League final in 2000? <laughs> Sharing them. No. Bro, that was 1999, treble year. Steve McManaman. 
Yeah, they showed him it was 99 with the treble, bro. Right, which British player scored oh, scored in the Champions League final in 1999? Teddy Sheridan. <laughs> which British player scored in the Champions League final in 2011? Really? I knew that, Wembley. Damn you, man. Which British player scored in the Champions League final in 2006? Oh, it was Liverpool. Oh. <laughs> Don't strain too hard. Steven Gerrard. No, bro. Sol Campbell, G. Which that British player be. scored in the Champions League final in 2008? Rooney. Frank Lampard. Is that when Chelsea done it? No. Which British player scored in the Champions League final in 2005? Steven Gerrard. Bang! That was the well final. Done. Well done, bro. That was the final. <laughs> Another show is in the oh, bag. If you've enjoyed this. the video, Drop it a like. If you're new to JD Football, hit the subscribe button. And uh, make sure you just keep supporting us, man. We love it. We love it. We've, we're seeing the progress. He's shining now because of the progress. This is fake, by the way. This is it's just, not fake, it's, man. It's, it's, it's cost 24, them jewelry. 24 carats straight from India. Let's do that handshake. Oh, yeah. Bang, 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 bang. Boom. I slapped you really hard there. I know. Aggressive. You're upset.